I've always wanted to be able to make my own homemade essential oils at home, but as I don't have the proper distilling equipment to separate the oil from the flower water using steam distillation, herbal infused oils are the next best thing. Lavender infused oil is made by steeping dried lavender buds in a carrier oil such as extra virgin olive oil, rosehip oil or jojoba oil for 4-6 to six weeks. Whole dry flower heads or just the petals can be used, but it is important that they're completely dry before they are placed in the oil to steep. While fresh flowers can technically be used to create lavender oil, this increases the risk for bacterial growth or the oil to become rancid due to the moisture content in the fresh buds. Therefore, I prefer to use dried flowers. However, if you want to capture the lavender fragrance and create more of a scented infused oil, fresh buds are more aromatic as the fragrance fades with the drying process. While the flowers are steeping, the natural active resins within the lavender are extracted and drawn into the oil, making it a concentrated oil full of the herb's healing properties. Herb-infused oils are a more gentle version of the therapeutic properties found in essential oils as they come in a more diluted form. The finished lavender oil can either be used on its own or used as an ingredient to create other products like natural salves, ointments or creams. Depending on the type of oil you choose to infuse the lavender buds with, this will likely dictate the uses for your finished lavender oil. For example, some oils are inedible, while others may not be great for skin. Some great uses for lavender infused oil include in a facial moisturiser, mixed in with the oil you use for oil cleansing, as a general moisturiser for your body as well as your face, as a massage oil, as a natural perfume, as an oil to help remove makeup, as an ingredient in homemade body care products like body butter, creams, balms, salves, ointments or soaps, as a hair serum to nourish hair, as an ingredient in homemade cleaning products and more. To make this lavender infused oil at home, start by harvesting the buds. Cut the lavender flowers off the plant, then tie them into a bunch and hang them upside down to dry in a dark dry place for 4 weeks or until completely dry. They take anywhere between 2-4 to four weeks to dry out. The lavender flowers will feel brittle once they're ready. Using two rubber bands per dried lavender bunch, tie one band just beneath the flower heads and one at the base of the stems. Then hang the bundles upside down to dry in a dark, warm spot. To retain the best colour, protect the drying lavender from sunlight and place a sheet beneath the bundles to catch any buds or blooms that might fall. Over the course of several weeks, the carrier oil extracts the natural plant properties found in the lavender, including traces of lavender essential oil. Lavender infused oil, therefore, carries the medicinal benefits of lavender as well as its scent. After drying, remove the rubber bands, then chop the lavender flowers into smaller pieces and remove the stems. Smaller pieces help make for a better extraction. Next, fill a clean glass jar with the lavender, then pour over the olive oil or other carrier oil of your choice so that all the flower material is completely covered. Use a spoon to mix the flowers through the oil, making sure that all pieces of lavender are coated and covered with the oil and any air bubbles are gone. Secure the lid tightly, then place the jar in a dark warm spot with no direct sunlight to infuse for 4-6 to six weeks, shaking it once or twice daily to help the oil infuse with the flowers. After 4-6 to six weeks, strain the oil through some cheesecloth or a nut milk bag then pour the oil into a clean, dark glass bottle for storage and keep it in a cool, dark place. This lavender oil will have a mild aroma to it. It will never be as strong as a true essential oil. To give the oil extra fragrance, you can add a few drops of your favourite organic lavender essential oil to enhance its aroma. And that is how you make a lavender infused oil at home. Thank you so, so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know if you try this recipe out yourself and how it goes. I'd love to know. I wish you a wonderful day or night wherever you are in the world. I send you all my love and I'll see you soon again.